Gear Seekers, I'm Nick. If you remember back to the last video we did in 2018 in the Cooler Master SL600M, you remember me talking about building a PC for my brother for his new music production and streaming PC. Both of us got really busy and we kind of put the project off for a little while. Well, well, that is until now. I'd originally built him an ITX system for the task, but he just didn't get time to pick it up, which is kind of my fault as well. So anyway, that aside, I decided that I would build him something in a case that was more suited to his workflow. In this video, I built my brother a decently powered music production and streaming rig featuring the Ryzen 7 2700X and the GTX 1660 Ti in a silent focus Cooler Master Silencio S400 MATX case. Let's do it. permanent system built from parts that we had on hand for two things music production and streaming not game streaming don't get that confused it's, yeah the, the only thing I, I really wanted to get out of this PC was that it had to be as quiet as possible without sacrificing performance this PC is a gift from Claire and I to my brother who's actually sitting there you can say hello if you want in the background Hi. Yeah, <laughs> he didn't pay a cent for it, and yeah, I would never charge my own family for a PC because we've got so many parts. But don't ask for free stuff on the internet. Also, make sure you watch to the end because we get a lot of comments about things in our build that are always answered if you watch the whole video. So yeah, just a heads up. Also, all the parts that we use for these builds we have on hand, we don't go out and buy parts of them except for this build. We bought a Wi-Fi card, but yeah. Enough about that. Let's uh, let's let, let let's do a build.
Let's talk parts because it's everyone's favourite bit of the video. The motherboard is the ASRock B450M Steel Legend. This board is amazing bang for buck and supports Ryzen 3000 with the BIOS update. We've used this board almost more than any other board on the channel and it was time for us to put it out to pasture and send it to a new home. The CPU we use is the AMD Ryzen 7 2700X. The 2700X is an eight core 16 threaded multitasking and content creation beast. This has easily been the most used chip on the channel since we started the channel and it's proven to be rock solid. Now this is the perfect chip for this system and we're slowly getting rid of a majority of our Zen Plus chips so yeah, it made sense to use the 2700X. To cool the 2700X, we use the Cooler Master ML240R RGB. We've used this cooler more times than I can remember, and if you want to know how to install this on an AM4 motherboard, guess what? There's a link in the top right-hand corner, and you can check that out right now. The GPU that was used was the Gigabyte GTX 1660 Ti Gaming OC. The reason why we chose this GPU was it doesn't use a lot of power, physically it's not a huge card, and it has NVENC, which is perfect for streaming. And that's what the other use of this computer is going to be used for. It's going to be playing piano on the internet and streaming on Twitch and people are going to donate. So make sure you uh, follow his Twitch. There's a link in the description. Okay, the RAM chosen was 16 gigs of XPG Spectrix D60G at 3000 megahertz. I chose this RAM because we've got heaps of it and it's really stable so yeah and it looks nice too all right lastly the case it's the cooler master silencio s400 this video is not a review of this case but we have reviewed this case and if you want to see the review 
There's a link in the top right hand corner right now. All right, ladies and gents, let's talk about fans and lighting and aesthetics because we know how much all you love all that. The cable extensions are the Cooler Master Paracord black and blue cable extensions. All the fans that we use are the Cooler Master MF120R ARGB fans connected up to the Cooler Master ARGB controller and configured in Master Plus. The rest of the lighting was configured in ASRock Polychrome Sync. It used to be Polychrome RGB, now it's Polychrome Sync. Anyway, uh, let's let's move on. Uh, so we're going to do something a little bit different. Um, I actually filmed the reaction of showing my brother the PC for the first time. Um, yeah, let's do that. It's a little bit different. Let's let's just show that now. Why did, I, why did I tell you guys? I could have just shown you. Well, the cat's out of the bag now. So this is my brother Gerard. You guys have never met him before. I've never had any family on the channel before, so... This is uh, a first for Gear Seekers. So um, I'm going to let him take the wraps off his new computer, which is over here. You're allowed to talk, by the way, Gerard. All right, I'm pretty excited. <laughs> no, 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 let, 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 let me... Um, I mean, at this stage of the video, you've already seen me building it. Give it a sec, it's still booting up. <laughs> I want the lighting to be right. Let's just take it off. You can have a look at your new music production computer. Yeah. Awesome. This is great. Yeah. Stuff on wow, it. that's amazing. It's got a SD card reader on the top. Yeah, it's pretty cool. All oh, right, my first computer. This is pretty amazing. Thanks, bro. I love you. Oh, now the mics are going to make fun of yourselves. <laughs> but yeah, hope you enjoy it. Um, hope you wow, make some dope new music out. with it. Water cooling. Yeah, it's going to be. Wow. It's pretty good. Um, this is pretty exciting. So with that said, uh, let's check out the benchmarks. All right, ladies and gents, I hope my brother likes this build. Do you like the build, dude? Yeah. Okay, we'll probably do a follow-up video once we have a little bit more time and like once he actually gets to using the machine, we'll talk about all that stuff. I didn't want to get into the specifics of music production or the streaming setup in this video because yeah, we'll do that in the follow-up and we probably would have been here for like four months if we did that anyway. The only thing that was left to add that you guys didn't see me doing was adding the PCI Wi-Fi card because it doesn't have built-in Wi-Fi and he's a loser that uses Wi-Fi. He uses Wi-Fi. Sorry, I just alienated our entire audience. Oh, there's also a PC part picker list in the description. You can peep all the parts that we used yourselves. Uh, let us know what you think of the build in the comments below. We've had heaps of requests for this build, so I thought it was time to pull my finger out and actually get it done. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. If you didn't like this video, you know what to do and do what the internet does and tell us what you hated about it. Once again, thank you, Sarah very much for watching. I'm your boy Nick with Gear Seekers. You peak. We seek. And my brother's here. He's going to show his face on the internet. So now your face will forever be on the internet. Don't be weird. Just show Hey guys. Face. This guy is amazing. Thanks very much for the computer. I can't wait to get it, get it kicking. Yeah. Thanks very much. Cool. That was really awkward for me. Now you guys know what it's like for me to be awkward on the internet. Thanks for watching. <laughs>